Hey guys, what is up? This is James and welcome to a new tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how you can make power grid in Vince Resolve. As I have promised yesterday, I will show you how you can save the color gradients non-destructively in the Vince Resolve and here it goes. So in the Vince Resolve, the settings that you can save for future uses for color grading, of course, that is called power grid. So here I have already opened a project so from here if i go to the color tab you see here on this clip i have already made some color gradings right here are the notes that i have used so now i want to save those notes so that i can use those for future color gradings if i make a lot that will not avail those settings right that will be applied directly the color gradings on top of my clip i'll not have any controls on that but if i save the power grid then i will be able to tweak the settings in the future so how you can do that in the color tab if you go to the left side top corner here you'll see gallery there you'll see steels power grid and timeline from there you can just grab a steel from your current clip and then you can save it for future uses when you grab a steel the vincent resort doesn't just grab the steel or just take a screenshot rather it saves all the color settings on that steel right so if i go to power grid you can see there are some power grid that i have saved previously and from here you can just grab a steel and save it there right so if i go to steel and then if i just right click on my preview panel i can grab steel here you can see grab steel option right so if i just click there it will make a steel here to use in the future you can just click and drag it here and you can save it in your power grid folder you will see here is the power grid steel now I can just name it. Maybe I can name it short film, right? So I can use that settings in the future when I need. Suppose here is a video. If I just clear all the settings from here, reset all grade and notes. Now I want to apply the color grid from the still. What I can do, I can just double click here to apply the color settings. You can see all the notes have been applied here and you can tweak the settings if you need suppose you want to change the exposure you can just change it from here you can tweak the white balance and whatnot everything is available for future uses so i will highly recommend you if you want to preserve the color grid for future uses you can make a power grid or you can grab it still then you can just name it here and you can organize it so that you can use it in the future projects so that is all for today i hope you have liked this video if you have liked this video and learned something new from this one then you can give me a thumbs up if you're new to this channel want to learn adobe premiere pro video editing or the vinci result then you can subscribe to this channel to get more awesome video just like this one i'll catch you guys on the next one until then goodbye